Hey, good morning. This is Billy Carter standing out in the middle of a cornfield here with Pascal Ag Operations down in Hazel, Kentucky. And a nice piece of corn. This hybrid right here happens to be DCAB 6618. Hey, as a fertility man, I'm always talking about fertility or always talking about a product and sometimes maybe a little too much and I don't talk about what we're actually looking for. Ray Charles can see that this corn is green top to bottom, 37,000 population. But I want to talk about something that having the right program and selecting the right hybrids means. As we go through here, I want, I want to stress this corn. So we see our ear placement here. And we just stay super, super, super consistent on our ear placement. Now, when you walk in your fields and you've got an ear there and then you've got an ear here or you've got an ear there, in my opinion and what I've seen is my yield is all over the board and is not consistent. On a single cross corn, I really like because they're going to give me consistent ear placements all through the field. When I have a good fertility program, with a good fungicide program, with a good insecticide program, with the proper amount of nutrients, I'm allowing this plant to express its true genetic potential to set even ears at the tallest node where it can make the most yield. So I was just wanting to give a video here basically on what I'm looking for if I go into a field, the very first thing I look at in determining one's yield factor is my ear placement evenness. And as you can see, it's just perfectly holding out. Contact your local Ag Explorer dealer, your Ag Explorer rep, if you want corn that was planted in April to still be green top to bottom, if you want even ear placement, and if you want knowledge to take you to the next level, your Ag Explorer dealer and your Ag Explorer rep can help you do that contact them anytime. Thank you. Y'all have a great day.